This tutorial demonstrates how to load XML data using Hippo Animator 2.7. XML is a way to store data in a text-based file. Create a new XML file from the library menu. The new file appears in the library and you can edit its content from the properties menu. An XML header has been added automatically, this is a standard line that you can ignore. XML documents are made up of nodes, attributes and text. Add a new node called text and add some text within it, this is a test. The text node is the first node of the XML document, and is known as the document element. You can only have one document element, so any more nodes must be child nodes within this node. The text within the text node is also a child node, here it is the first child in the document element. Add a text box object to the library, and place it in the center of the movie. We are going to set the text of this text box, to the text in the XML file. Set the script ID to, test text. In the movie properties, open the general script. To open the XML file from the library, use the function, open XML. Set the file name to xml file 1 and set the function to result the result function is called when the xml is loaded now create the result function the result function receives an xml object as its only parameter you'll need to check the status of the xml object 200 means everything worked okay it's important to remember that when you export to html the XML object will return zero, if the XML file is not loaded from a web server or local host. Display an alert if the status is not equal to 200. Use the text box set function to set the text in the text box. Set its script ID to, test text, and set the text to, XML, dot, document element, dot first child, dot node value. This will give the value of the text, this is a test, in the XML document. Press play to see the result. Again, remember, when exporting to HTML, any XML files you use must be hosted on a web server or local host, or they will return status equal to zero.